Hello, we're finally there. It took us only about what? Six or seven or eight hours. I'm not sure how much time I needed to clear basically the entire DLC. Um, I think there are a few spots I didn't search, but I don't think there will be anything interesting in them. Uh, this is a dead end. I think I searched all of the corners of the map. I don't think there is anything interesting in the wishing well either. I think I missed only a few locations that basically I'll need to fish or find uh, more lobsters, but... Lost forest. <laughs> Other than that, we're okay. So we're in the middle of the map, in the radiation zone and... Without the radiation. Why did I do that? That was not necessary. Ivory Mountain Research Laboratory. Yeah. These guys sound like very, very bad guys. Okay, before I go into the laboratory, let me see if there is something else around the building. Nah, just building materials. Oh yeah, the fireplace. Yeah, in case there's something that might kill me. So what is this place called? Probably the Ivory Mountain Co. Corporation. Lobsters, no. <laughs> oh, I thought that was a tower, but it's not. Yeah, as you can see, my mom is getting ready for more construction back home. Yeah, we don't use the main doors. A link tower that is ancient. We... What? We should receive another st steel delivery from the foundry. Foundry point next week. I think we went to the foundry point and there was nothing there. <laughs> yeah, I cannot find it on the map right now, but I'm sure we were, we were there. Crown Tower works well enough as a test bench. As a test bench? I guess the link towers that they build on the surface originated from this place. <laughs> they need a new, new ideas. How modern? And what did they invent? Probably something terrible. They're nice facilities. They had very nice facilities. Oh, this is the break room. The break room or the broken room. Also, destroying the refrigerators gives you good stuff, but I don't really do it that much. <laughs> so much rice in this area. I guess the rice is kind of like a very good cooking item. I mean, the rice is one of the most used cooking items. So it kind of makes sense they would give you a lot of it in here. Hey, okay. Also, we'll level up in this episode, I'm sure of it. Nothing good on the radio these days. If you remember, I tried to tune in the radio a lot of times and it didn't work. So I'll stop trying. Oh, a fedora. And we get a critical hit chance. Okay, that's... Well, I guess the helmet is a defensive item, and that's an offensive item. <laughs> we'll probably use the fedora all the time. Okay, just a second. Let me see what's in here, and then we'll go make the fedora. Product ideas for mana, gasoline replacement, jewelry with fedems, fancy armor for your flippers, wireless electricity. Invigorating medicine product. Oh, I guess they try to use the mana in all ways possible. <clears throat> well, I guess it can be a replacement for everything. But that also probably brought their downfall. Demonstration of the energy release next month. 
yeah, the potential is limit limitless, but they have to get the patents. Patents is basically I don't know copyright. Yeah, they will own the copyright for that stuff. Ah, still not enough to level up. I suppose the suit and the fedora are strictly DLC items, I don't know. Probably. <laughs> we look ridiculous. We, we look like a character from Tom and Jerry. I suppose the fedora hat is also super hard to upgrade. I then rubber, okay. This is the easy upgrade. Fabric and bone. Oh, it's not so bad. Lumber and mana beads. 10% critical chance and a backstab critical hit chance plus 25%. So, yeah, that means we'll basically either stun or crit with every hit almost. So, crit critical. Wait, what? Well, I cannot really tell what sort of critical chance just by watching this, so it's 10. Backstamping damage and... I guess it shows you your chance without the close modifiers or I don't know. I don't know. I don't care that much anyway. So let's go and see what the quest wants us to do. Inspect the old. Huh? He's dead. Oh, that's the one, one of the broken ones. Four, oh no, four titanium and eight still. Oh, come on, game. Why are you doing this to me? Why are you doing this to me? I just, I think I just upgraded something the other episode. Nah. Can I build a refinery somewhere? I mean a smelter. No, I suppose not. Oh, I can. <clears throat> so I guess we'll have we'll need a lot of this and a lot of this. Yeah, I think you can build stuff everywhere now, or I'm not exactly sure how it works, but... I guess we can use the leaves. Ah, let's just make eight. <clears throat> and also, we haven't slept in a very, very long time. Remember, you also get the buff for sleeping. It also doesn't matter because it's always daytime in here. So through the power of sleeping, wow, that takes kind of slow. I feel refreshed, 11 max HP. Huh, also completed another sleeping quest. Oh, actually I only needed the titanium, okay. New invention, campfire triangulation. Uh, well, let's see the campfire triangulation then. <laughs> it's broken, but I think it can be repaired. I don't see the triangulation. Mm, maybe we just need to activate it. Okay, activate.
This link there has a lot of mana near it. It's powered by a lot of mana. Acquired map for the underworld area. By the way, now if you activate the link tower, it will also give you the map so you can kind of explore the entirety of the map. Yes, I didn't miss much as you can see only this part over here which I don't think it has anything. Maybe here there is something and this... I don't think there is anything in, the, in these areas. Transmitter, scanner. Deadly ascension. So you can link the towers to have fast travel with camps. But that's a lot of resources that I need to spend. Uh, okay, apparently we have to install it anyway. This is working now as well. Should I? No, 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 no. <laughs> what am I searching for? I think I investigated everything. I guess we should overload this one. <clears throat> it sounds like a bad idea, but I'll do it anyway. Back in the cage suburb. Thank you, game. Oh, so that's why the sinkholes appear. Yeah, hey, more or less, because we're technically in another dimension. I have no idea what is going on. Island in the end. End of what? <laughs> it does. I think this place doesn't really want me here anymore. Oh, it's an island to the left of the map. That's what you get for breaking things, I guess. Oh. I like the smiley faces. They kind of... Tell you the tone of the lines. As soon as we arrived, we've been led here and now it wants us to leave. I don't think I'll leave. Well... I guess we're in for a fight, maybe. <laughs> Did they try to leave with a boat or what? Also, no fishing spots. Oh, okay. <clears throat> So I guess the entire point is that, well, I forgot how we entered the underworld already. Why is that campfire not activated? Did I forget to activate it? Uh, I'll have to do it another time, or maybe they added it later. I forget, I forgot what we used to enter the underworld, but now it, apparently you can just go to the, 
Oh, that's our building. You can just go to the Cape Pass and then you'll enter the... Oh, it's actually pretty good because you have a campfire over here to the underworld. The color of money structures and as a result, the world has suffered the consequences. New ways have been opened to explore what was left behind. Give me the, the reward. The reward is nothing. <laughs> So can we fast travel again? Yes, we can indeed fast travel again. So before I do anything else, let's let's look at the map a little bit. So yeah, this might be something I can teleport to, but I don't think it's a location. Those are different in our locations. Oh, okay, so I missed this thing over here. Eh, it doesn't look important. I mean, I still don't understand the purpose of this boss fight over here. I mean, like I said, we did a very good job of follow exploration everywhere. We explored most of the stuff. Yeah, I don't think we can explore this part either. Is this a huge crystal in the water? Maybe, but how do you get over there? Hmm. We might need to destroy some blocks, so I'll probably have to farm. Yeah, I still didn't I still didn't do that quest. Maybe we need to destroy some blocks. I guess I will have to upgrade the fist after all. <laughs> For a proper 100 percent exploration. Let's try to do that quest. Wait, what's the fastest way to get there? Shattered suburbs, okay. I'm not sure how we can do it. Or why we should do it? Why is the crystal important? The crossbow has a... Oh, I didn't look at this. Yeah, it has a scope on it. Well, I don't think I'll need the hammer, to be honest. Six mana spirit in an active mana chamber. Well, that's stupid. Bones in one mana bit. Well, that's going to be tricky to pull off. I mean, I'll try only once. I don't want to try more than once. <laughs> oh, we only had one mana bit anyway. Not sure about this quest. This seems like it's very specific in my opinion.
Or should I say too specific? Oh, they are much weaker in the mana field. Okay, forget about that. Yeah, that zombie will have to remain. It's a stupid quest. So you basically have to activate the mana field and then... It's a stupid quest. I don't want to think about it. Yeah, you basically have to round up all of those guys and then activate... I mean, you, uh, basically you have to do is take the resources, put them in the mana chamber over there and then kind of round up all of the enemies and then activate the mana chamber because if you activate it beforehand it will not last long enough or you will you lose the buffs when you leave the mana chamber so i don't understand this quest why is it, does it have to have such a stupid design if you can if you had to kill only three of them i would be i would agree with it but six so that's one two three Four, five. Yeah, that's the way you have to do it, otherwise it will not work. So I counted five. The, the sixth one probably was somewhere around there. <laughs> ah, okay, so what about this place? Is it really worth it? Go I don't think we can go over there. But let's try. Campfire of Solitude. Let's explore this area a little bit and then we'll go away. Okay, it's just a lot of dogs around here. Yeah, look at this. The basic range attack of the Kopesh can stun now. Yeah, like I said, I didn't expect to find anything over here anyway. This looks like it lit somewhere. Oh, it just leads to this place again. Yeah, so nothing interesting here as either. <clears throat> so I really think that was the dog that was that was the boss that we killed in the guy in the suit. Hmm, but I don't, I don't understand why we had to kill him. Oh, okay, at least this place has a secret. Ah, exactly what I needed. Can I level up? I think I can level up now. Yeah, I think that's enough to level up. So, there was a treasure over there. And I don't think I can reach this place. It looks like I can go there, but I... Eh, whatever. Let's go. It's a short 
Little journey anyway. I mean, it looks like it's a short journey, but who knows? <laughs> so many leaves. Well, I guess all of the leaves will be needed as fuel. As fuel for my industry. Yeah, I'll probably die because the lock on system is one of the stupidest things ever invented in video gaming and I still hate it. I mean, I was trying to hit the monster near me but because of the lock on system <laughs> I was hitting everything except the guy near me. Okay, so what? Oh no, we didn't get the... Wait, is that park only one level? Farmer, Fisher... Well, probably farmer is the best choice because I normally would pick doctor, but we don't have any more combat to do. Okay, let's go again. Okay, that was not so bad. <clears throat> Sorry for this video being a little longer again. Next video will be about building our base. I also got stuck in the weird... Am I going the right way? Nope. In the terrain. I got stuck in the terrain a little bit. <laughs> Don't scream. Ah. That scream is so annoying with this high pitch. Yeah, I got stuck in this platform over here because it's not very clear where you can climb. Oh, that's a deer over there. By the way, that's the icon for an animal. It doesn't explain how deer got here and what they are doing. Uh, just a lot of crates over here. Oh yeah, this is a place we didn't explore before. Oh, it has a ruined windmill. Well, this is not a golf course, so I'm not sure what to do with it. Upgrade damage to 95, okay. <laughs> I have to remember to come and destroy that thing. Maybe it's a... Uh, Secret of some kind or, I don't know, an easter egg. Wait, why is there an arena over here? Is this the only arena on the island? I think it is. Yeah, we still have one quest over there. Oh, we have one obelisk over there as well. Okay, let's try and do the obelisks. I should return with the blue eye orb. Oh man, this is so annoying. Oh, what is that? A fish? Oh no, I fell in the water. <laughs> I fell in the water and I cannot get up. So why did we respawn over here again? No clue. I don't think we can go from the colony of the divided over here. But wait, if I fast travel that means all of my items will be lost. So what? Well, I guess I'll just have to take them back again.
Yeah, that's a bit of a downside. Okay, I guess I can do the two obelisks. So just go north. The dogs are very annoying. You don't see me. Yeah, I want to finish the obelisks in this episode because otherwise I'll have to come back. And I don't want to do anything else in the underworld. I think there are only two obelisks. I don't think there are more. Yes, bring it on. You know, that was kind of hard for level 1. I hope it doesn't get much harder than this. Otherwise I might have to, you know, give it my best. Oh, these obelisks are hard. Well, I guess they're not that hard, but they're harder than what I was expecting. I, uh, I hope I'll not run out of healing, because that would be annoying. I'll have to do the last one in the next episode, because this is not as easy or as fast. Okay, send. That still was not bad, to be honest. <laughs> well, can it get harder than all of these guys? Probably yes. Very mediocre reward, in my opinion. Okay, let's heal before we kill the last ones. That was pretty dangerous. Hey, that's unfair. Why is that one out of the ring? Why is that one out of the ring, really? Plant growth speed 50%. Well, to be honest, I think I don't need the bonus the obelisk gave me, the other obelisk gave me. I think I had a movement speed bonus, but we already killed everything. So let's activate this one. Yeah, I don't know what bonus I had, but I can tell you I didn't need it. Okay, that was interesting. See you next time. Bye. Actually, before I end the video...
<laughs> that was a very uh, lackluster death. I want to teleport outside because I want to see, I want to see something. Let's travel island of the dead. But I don't think anything will change. We didn't finish exploring the island outside. So Cape Pass. Oh yeah, it's nothing. I guess we just have to lower the bridge. I think... Yeah, that's all we have to do over here. Yeah. Okay, this was very nice. So in the next episode, we'll have to do the other obelisks and also a lot of base building. Bye.